Okay, here the clutch is disengaged. And what the customer did is they partially engaged it to the point of right here is where it's where you just you can't turn it. It's partially engaged. Uh, and they just put it to this position and then uh, wired, you know, held it in there. It doesn't put enough of pressure on the, uh, the plate. Uh, it, it wasn't fully engaged. And here's here you can see and feel the click when it goes over center, locks into the lock position. That's disengaged and that's engaged. Now this you know, it takes a little bit of muscle to put it into in engage. And now to adjust it since it's smoked, you remove the inspection cover plate. And uh, there's a little dowel pin in here. You take a screwdriver, push this dowel pin back, and uh, can you see that on the video? Very good, let's have a flashlight. Let's go get a flashlight on my desk. Right here, there's a little dowel pin. You can see that, it's spring-loaded. Let me do this again. That dowel pin pushes back. Okay, then while that's back in place, you take a hammer and a punch and uh, there you go. There, now you can see that. You can see that dial pin work very good. That's what holds the nut from turning. That's a safety lock. Okay, now with that disengaged, uh, you take a hammer and a punch and you tighten this by pounding on the nut like that. That turns the nut tighter and puts more pressure on your uh, clutch plate. If you have too much pressure on it, you won't be able to lock it in. You can actually see these little, get me sleek. You can actually see these little links here go over center right there. There's Santa. There's, there it's disengaged. When it locks in place, you can see them go over center and it puts pressure in. What we're doing by holding this lever in place is it's wearing out this brass piece that disengages and engages it because there's continuous pressure on it. And there's no bearing there, it's just a, a brass piece that wears. Uh, that is the issue. If there is, if, if uh, the clutch plates were damaged uh, from holding it in place, all these bolts out here have to be removed. Uh, you do that, remove it, and then uh, these there's clutch plates in here with little fingers that have to be replaced, and uh, and it has to be reinstalled. Uh, but hopefully, you can just adjust it out by what I was saying there. Uh, okay, any more questions? Uh, contact us. Thank you. Other than they stop when I can, bro. Sorry, help me.